Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and welcome to Blade of Arena. Now, this is a demo, by the way, so it's not going to be like a full, complete game or anything like that. But, it did look interesting from like its screenshots and a little bit of the trailer from what I've seen. Uh, it seemed more like an RPG. More of an action RPG, let's say that. I'm not sure if it's going to be like, well, it is multiplayer. Because I saw in the trailer it said multiplayer co-op stuff like that, but I didn't really see a lot of it. All I saw was like the PvP part of it. So yeah, this game did take like a long time to download. By the way, seems like they got a lot of skins here you can choose from. Uh, I'm just gonna go with let's go with the less creepy eyes. Oh god, the little tail. I'm gonna go with this one. But yeah, it doesn't seem like there's a lot. Oh, okay, never mind. But to say it doesn't seem like there's a lot of character creation, but actually he is. You can't change the hair color though. Of like each hair. So I'm guessing that's gonna be added sooner or later. Whenever they uh complete it. What was the outer hair that I actually liked? I found like a decent hair and now it's all gone. Wait, did the hair that I saw change colors? I think it did. Sure, we're just gonna go with this. We're just gonna go with that. That'll be fine. So it seems like... Hold up. What? Oh, so I can choose my ears too. Cool. I'm just gonna go with these and we can choose horns as well I don't think we can take off the horns though so the horns are there to stay I wish I could change the color of them so I'm gonna go with those horns so you can't choose outfits it seems like you could choose your weapon of choice so they have a normal sword and shield. You can pick your shield you want to go in with. Noted. They have a great sword. I'm guessing that's what... Now, is it a great sword? I guess let's just call that a long sword. I think that's more of what it is. This one actually looks pretty sick. Now there is a katana. There's only one katana though. And then there is dual katanas, okay. I'm gonna go with the normal katana. Now we can change our name here. I'm gonna go with Wolf. And let's go back to the skin. Oh, clothes. Meh. I think I like this one. I'm gonna go with this. Let me just look at the rest of her first. Yeah, they're all right. I can carry like a little pouch. I can carry glasses. I'm gonna go with the pouch. So it seems like there's six areas I can explore: the plains, river, undead, snow, desert, and shrine. Let's go ahead and save. Yeah, there goes that character. Perfect. Okay, so you. So it does have like night and day cycle. God, the sun looks like it's gonna be like really bright. I think I prefer nighttime. Now let's go to. Hmm. Let's start off at the planes. So this game did take a while to download, like a pr pretty decently long time. I'd probably say like. Like, I want to say 20 minutes, 20 to 30. Oh, God. I was about to say, there's a lot of lag. So it's probably, like, straining on my PC. No. All right, the combat isn't too bad. Oh, you bastard. How dare you? So there is a stamina system. 
All of a sudden, are you gonna run away? You're gonna run away like a little coward? How dare you? Yeah, that'll teach you. So is there like a... Oh, so control... Is dodge. Or more of a dash. Why does everything feel like they need to attack me? Especially when I'm just chilling. So it doesn't seem like there's, like, for what I see, um, XP, an XP bar from what I see. I was going strength. Alright. There is a sprint, though. But you do use stamina. So there's not really an objective or quest from what I see. How do I put away my sword? I, I push X and I did something. Oh, okay, so this is this is a demo, so you do have, like, a cheat button, which is pretty much X. I don't really know what these talents do, I just chose one. It doesn't, like, hover over and see the talent or anything. You can't, like, hold it and look at it. Nothing like that. I destroy these boxes? No? Okay. I'm not gonna use the um, X. Well, I guess because it doesn't seem like they have an XP bar. I guess it's like that. Or maybe I'm wrong. Okay, I just leveled up from killing that thing. Oh no, now that I use the XP button. Does it just level me up every time? Aww. Really wish I didn't do that. I wish it was more like in the main menu for stuff like that. Okay, I didn't level up again. Okay, there is an XP bar. It's just literally under me. that blue bar right there I believe yeah it's the blue bar thankfully I'm not like auto leveling anymore so you can't hold an attack these enemies are like really really aggressive like I want to get out of here dude what do you want are you did you just stop it no. Bad. Come back here. You're gonna run away from me? Why is everybody such a coward of fighting me? Alright, let me... Do I have an inventory? Yes, I do. So does it slowly regen? Yeah, okay. So food slowly regens my HP. Okay, B and I are for my bag. It's kind of hard to see your HP bar with this coloring, though. That I can't say. This game is free on Game Jolt, too, to try out. At least the demo is. I'm not sure about the full game when it comes out. Which, for the demo, it seems like they're going to have a lot of work to do. What? what? Now, let's go ahead and get out of here. We've, we've been here. For quite a while. Let's go see some other stuff. What? Oh, oh god. Yeah, there's just aggro everywhere. Guys, chill. I was about to say, I have the high ground now, boy. But nope, never mind. I don't have it. Alright, so this is another camp. Does this, like, replenish my HP if I was to sit in here? Are they allowed to come in here? Yes, they are. So I don't really have enough time to look into my bag either. Unless there's, a, like, a quick... Unless there was, like, a quick way of getting into my bag. So 
So this is overtime. All food is overtime. Alright, did I just put all that into my sword? I think I did. Okay, yeah. Oh, okay. Dinner replace. Okay. I get it. Want to drag that one in? Can I put it down here? No. For, so this is for just something else that we don't know of yet. Armor and damage. Doesn't seem to be any HP. There is an all-around one. So this, so I'm guessing the second one is for like sword stats. Seems like we got some other stats here. Uh, let's go with let's go with this one. That one seems more interesting. I keep pushing escape because I think it's gonna close this screen. I think inside of here. Nope. From what I see, I can't really do anything else with it. Alright, now we're doing, like, way more damage. Perfect. Alright, let's go over here. What's over here? Ah, he seems like a... Seems like a boss is over here. Yeah, I could take care of that guy pretty easy. Let's see if I can take care of this guy. Oh god. The hitbox is kind of weird. Jeez. That was like a really weird hitbox. I oh gotta look at everything he's ate. Jeez. Not today. Oh. Thanks for the bread, though. Stop it. Okay, there is one thing I want to see. Settings, settings, settings. Let's go ahead and go to mouse and stuff. Nope, there is no actual mapping for my keys or anything. Okay, so I don't know what button is which. I guess I did have to, like, keep track of everything on the site. Because they did have, like, I think all the keys on the site. But this is a multiplayer game, so I can't really pause it. And I'm pretty sure if I do go look at the site, they're, <laughs> they're going to attack me. Come back here, you scum. Doink, what do you want? What, you thought you were going to take me out? Got an OP sword now. Just look at all my damage. Okay, it doesn't seem like I've leveled up yet. So I need something else to kill. You guys, come here. There we go. Perfect. Everything into damage. So there's no jump attacks. Noted. Ooh, that place looks cool. Let's go over there. That is not my goal. Well, I'm at it. I'm gonna start pushing different buttons. Okay, so tab is to uh, draw and put my sword back. N is map. Okay. What is J? H? F? D? Oh, well, D is just to move right, duh. T, Y, U, P, O, nope. What about numbers? Nothing? You don't want that to be. I one shot everything now. Ow! I didn't even hit you and you're acting like you're down. Calm down. Alright. Guys, can we be civilized about this? I'm just going over here to this cool looking place. I really wish I had like a boner or something to fight these flying dragon with. 
Because they actually look interesting to fight. I want to go over there too. I don't think we can do that. Wait, did you really just cross the bridge to... Nani? Oh, okay. What ifs? Uh, not like I care or anything. <laughs> Wish there was a way to like combine these. That would be interesting. And there I go again, pushing escape just to get out of that stuff. What, you want something too? How do I, how do I get over there? Is there a bridge? I don't think there's a bridge. Nah, no, there's not a bridge. Feels bad. And I can't slice that. How does one get over there? I guess one cannot get over there. There seems to be enemies over there, though. From what I do see. Look at those. Oh, no, there's not an enemy. That's a windmill. Wonder, can we jump out the map? Yes, we can. What happens if we... Oh, just respawns us? Okay. <laughs> I thought something interesting was actually going to happen. Apparently not. How did I even miss that attack? Give me that. Mine now. I'm about to say, can I, can I hit like multiple people with like one swing with this animation? No, it doesn't seem like it. Stop running from me and accept your fate. Okay, my backpack's full. I don't know where to get rid of this stuff. You guys haven't gave, given me like a shop or anything. Alright, now that I got this place clear, let me go back to the site and see all my buttons. Okay. So, the buttons are just pretty standard. They don't say anything about the X button, which is pretty weird and random. But clearly this is still like a work in progress type of thing, guys. So don't, don't judge it too much. Stop. Go away. But judge it as you see it, I guess. <laughs> it eh, has potential. Take this guy out. Hey, stop it. Stop following me. Oh, give me... Oh, I can't carry the bread? Uh, wait, what? Couldn't you just stack it in there? No? Okay, whatever. Let's get rid of some of these since we can't really carry a lot. Get rid of him. Why is he, why are you stepping in the fire? I can step in the fire too. Apparently that guy had a build hey, stop it. I got, I'm kinda curious of what the death screen looks like. Does anything happen to my stats? Rank go oh, okay, apparently there's ranks. Return to the main. Wait a minute. Is this pretty much just a survival thing? Is that it? Is it just like PvP with other players? I guess that's what it is. Let's explore the other places and see what they look like since we got a few minutes. I just want to at least get a glance of what they look like. Oh. This one looks interesting. Do I carry my stats over? No, I do not. So it said MOBA and Battle Royale. So I'm guessing you were supposed to find all these enemies and survive the longest against other players. That's weird. I thought it was like a straight up RPG, but apparently not. It is like a MOBA slash PvP game front of ranking screen just explaining that pretty much just put those on and now I'm pretty much just a 
overall beast. But that's kind of unfair to have like just this X button that I can just spam the hell out of and get all these mini skills that literally just max level me. I can just put all these stats in, you know what? Full HP, full strength, full agility. That that that's kind of really strong. But then again, I haven't found a single player, so can't really say much about of it. About it. Did you just pull me, and you just rooted me, you jerk? So this is. The, um, river map. Oh, you could... Okay. Alright then. Let's go look at the other maps. That was weird. I'm just gonna look at one more map. The other three will be for you guys to explore. So let's go see the undead map. I think that's the one I'm most curious about. Ow. Oh. Okay, why did I look up? Oh, they got some skeleton enemies here. Alright, so these are automatically inside of my inventory. No matter what I do. So you just pretty much get like a starter kit before you go in and fight somebody. That's... I don't know how I feel about that. Okay, could, could, can you not? I get it, you're OP. You're stronger than everybody else. That's cool, stop. <laughs> I wanna go there. Yeah, you you do that all you want. I wanna go here. Oh, look at this enemy. Let's get ready just to wreck him. Could you not? Rude? Rude. Dude, that's very rude. That's could could you not? Oh dear god, what's all in here? This looks like a fun place to be. What do you want from me? Okay, it does look like it can hit multiple people. Thankfully. Look at this guy. Oh, now he's dead. I guess that's pretty much all I can show you guys. I don't really think there's anything else really all that unique about this game um from the looks of it eh, it's definitely not a game that I feel like a lot of players can get into and considering that there really isn't people on here which means it's very under the radar and not many people have actually noticed that it exists so I would recommend I guess giving the game a try? If anything? It it does take a while to install and plus your computer might tell you that it's hey, you sure you wanna download this? This is like unknown publisher crap and yeah, I already installed it. Nothing wrong. I'm gonna probably uninstall it because I don't see a reason for me to play it any further. So, yeah, like I said, take it with a grain of salt. It's very... Meh? I mean, it seems like a cool concept, but... Yeah, definitely not for me. I'm not a huge fan of MOBAs or Battle Royales. So, yeah. Until then, hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out. Let anyone tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. We're gonna make it soon. Just keep pushing through. Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through. Cause what you
what you got to lose.